Hey guys, and welcome back to Dead Space. When we last left off, we discovered N Nicole is not exactly as dead as we thought she would be. And we've got the uh, final upgrade to our flamethrower, which is really freaking cool. We just need to feed it. Lots of delicious upgrades. Which we definitely plan to do. Any more? Judging by the music, there's probably more. Any more? No? 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 Well, fuck the lot of you then. I'll go play by myself. Um, thank you. <laughs> Alright, so. Now we have to launch the SOS beacon, but. Uh, can't get to the crew deck yet. We can find the report on the bridge. And we can. I mean, technically we don't have to do these ones anyway. Because, you know, I've already got the code. But we're going to do them anyway, just for the sake of it. Um, Alright, cool. Let's go up to mining. So we can get our little flamethrower to be all it can be. Now, I would say little flamethrower, but actually this thing is monstrous. Uh, as I think I previously said uh, in the original game, apparently the flamethrower was ass, which is interesting. Ah, for God's sakes. I'm guessing to solve the power problem, we're going to have to murder everything. Yep. Yep, we're going to have to murder everything. Alright, well, that's fine. Okay. Not awful, I guess. Would be better if I could see what I was doing. And they they did drop goodies, but I don't know where the goodies went. Alright, come on you. Yeah, mum. Let's have enough of your nonsense. Grind your ass into the ground. You're dead. You're dead. Any more? Of course there's more. There's always more. There we go. Let's try and stomp your ass into the ground. If we can. There we go. Grind you into a fine paste. Lovely. Just what the doctor ordered. Now. Someone's been knocking back a beer here. That's fine, I understand. Humans stay out. Uh, who writ that? The necro's been writing that? Because, I don't know, dude. That seems pretty sus to me. Also, uh, we might have a problem here. Um. In fact, I definitely think we've got a problem here. Uh. Where's the the barrel that we can block these lasers off with? Um Ah uh, Oh right. Okay, apparently we were having some kind of 
effect happen to us. Didn't realize. Yeah, this is going to be problematic. Luckily, I guess there's more than one way to skin a necromorph. Hopefully. Is that going to work? Alright. We, we kind of got lucky there. I don't know where our block is that we used to block that off first time. And I can definitely say with confidence it does not disappear. Absolutely is not meant to disappear. So that's curious to say the least. Come on, don't be difficult now. Don't be difficult. There we go. Alright, cool. Where the f bloody hell's the block? Honestly. Beware, traps ahead, yeah. Seriously, where's th where did the block go? They've all disappeared. That's genuinely really strange. Alright, well, whatever, I guess. No point worrying about it. Oh. Do we... Do we just break the lasers? Is that a thing that you can do? You can permanently disable the lasers? With a body? Kind of curious now. You can. I guess. I guess I say. I don't know why that would be a thing actually. Alright, well, that's going to make things a little bit safer around here. So, if you use a corpse, you can break the lasers. Is it any corpse? Is that because it can only do X amount of damage to a thing? before it breaks. I guess that's what it is. It only do a small like a finite amount of damage before it's used up. And I guess if it's impacting like a ordinary prop that doesn't count. Ha, huh. you learn something new every day, guys. Right. Well, we know there's an upgrade bench over there. We know there's a shop here. So, what do we want? We want to sell that for another 10 grand. Uh, we've already got two nodes, but let's buy a couple more. I don't know, four more, that'll give us six. I guess, and then we can buy some more flamethrower fuel. So let's be fair. This flamethrower is where it's at. Okay. Let's go upgrade our flamethrower. Make our little flamethrower all it can be. Uh, a new special ability. Okay. So. What does that do? Macro liter fuel tank. Macro liter fuel tank? What does that do? Greatly increases fuel capacity. Alright, cool. Well, alright, oh, yeah, of course. Alright, my bad. So we go for duration. Damage goes up to 90 points, which is nice, actually. Capacity, capacity. 110. Okay. So our flamethrower is as big and as bad as it could possibly be. That's what we like. So what else did we have? We had the contact beam. Which... Right, I remember. Yeah, wasn't it the... Secondary fire that seems to do all the damage. Right, okay. Cool. 
So what's our little flamethrower look like now? Now it's all maxed out. Ooh, the tank's re the tank is now yellow instead of what color was it for? Red, I think. Oh, he ah, hello, text log. Do we not get this? Uh, yes, we did read this. This is the one where what's her name becomes unconscious and dies. Linjin, yeah. Okay, so we definitely did read that. Odd. Okay. Might be something to do with a patch that happened. Uh, there was a patch that I had to download before I actually played this game. Um, but it was only like, you know, 500k or something, so... Alright. Plenty in the tank. Knocked. Oh, yeah. Storage room. We do like our storage rooms. Ooh. Little eyes. Little eyes. What secrets have you seen? Ah. Uh, okay. This guy went a little bit doolally by the look of him. Not sure if he's actually removed his eyes. Doesn't look like it. Right, well, let's have some cash. Because we've just burnt through an obscene amount of cash. Take us a while to restock that. Alright, well, I mean, yeah, okay. Not bad, I suppose. Oh, hello. Evening. Not what you expect as soon as you open the door, is it? But then I suppose we should be expecting it. Right. Get a stasis tube out. I didn't realise that we could grab and pull these things around without them exploding. I thought as soon as they hit the ground they were going to blow up. I don't know why I thought that, but whatever. Okay, let's try that again. Administrator access granted. Prepping launch tubes. Oh, goody gumdrops. What was that? The miners must have booby trapped the launch tubes too. They're scrap. Well, that's great. We can't just toss the beacon out a window. Uh, there's got to be something. Mm. The asteroid. The one in the mining bay for smelting. Mm. What about it? If I attach the SOS beacon to that asteroid and then launch it away from the ship, we'd get a clean broadcast. And you'd get yourself killed. The machinery in there is still running, Isaac. Then it probably kept those things out, too. This is our best shot, Kendra. I'm taking it. Uh, it probably kept those things out. Um, I, I doubt it. I'm just going to say, I straight up, straight up, I doubt it. Right, let's get you over, dude. No need to waste good ammunition on this guy. Oh, hello. Same with you, pal. Come on, on your back with it grind you into a fine powdery paste. There we go. I guess we might as well use these modules if we've got them. Now we're covered in necro blood again. Fan dabby dozy. Okay, so to the asteroid. At least that blood doesn't take long to disappear from our suit. Okay. Boop. Ah, well this place looks safe, doesn't it? Looks very safe.
I'm gonna have to do more than that, mate. Just saying. Flame of fuel. Alright. That'll do. I'll take that as an apology. Hey, dude. Didn't even have to kick an apology out of him. He just kind of dropped it. Alright, what are we looking at here? Okay, okay, I see. So we need to go up there. Now, if I was a power supply, where would... Ah, right, we've got one in the other room, haven't we? So I'm... Yeah. And not only is there one in the other room, it's one of the ones that's exposed and doesn't go back in. Okay. I'm picking up what you're putting down, game. Almost as if I've done this once before. I actually forgot about this, though. <laughs> Oop. Oh, hello. Calm down, big fella. Calm down. That's quite enough of your nonsense today. Come on. There you go. Don't need to be such a penis. There's enough meat on this rig for all of us. nice what do we got in here I got some money supplies oh look at that stasis pack another stasis pack gold semiconductors dude you were really holding out on us weren't you you son of a bitch not too shabby not too shabby at all Oh, God, hello. Oh, hello. I see we tried to do their game. Try to pincer me in. Dick. Now, fun fact. This bit that we're about to do, I could easily see ruining quite... I'm sure there's a save point here somewhere, isn't there? No, I think this is actually a checkpoint. I can see this bit ruining loads of hardcore runs. Because this bit is kind of finicky. Yep. We've got a plan, don't worry. Not sure how good our plan really is, but I guess it's the only one we get, so it's probably the best one. Okay. Anything else? Yeah, these blades that sweep across the asteroid um, yeah, if they hit you, game over, man. And it's not as hard as you might think to get hit by them. And if you die, well, you know, you die, and that's rip your run. So, I can only imagine the frustration of getting all the way through here. To this point of the game and then dying all right and you know what happens as soon as you accomplish anything enemies spawn
Gotta love that action horror. Ooh. <laughs> burn, baby, burn. Yeah, these are all the uber hard enemies as well. Max level, guys. Man. That's rough. The trouble with the max level, guys, is they take so much to kill. Uh, let's try and use the force gun on them. Wow, they're tough. Jesus. Well, you didn't like that. Pretty sure there's one more somewhere. Uh, okay. Best way to find out is stand still. Nope, we're good. Wow, we're really out of energy for this. Come on. Um, guessing we're going to get attacked again. No, I think we're okay. Right. This is the fuck factor. Oh man. God, I hate this thing. Oh, yep. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. Fucking knew it. God damn it. Now imagine if that was your hardcore run. Never been a fan of uh, one hit instant death in games. Let's go for round two. Run! Remember your training! Okay. Oof. Alright, what are we looking at? So, there we go. Let's get you done. Hello, you little shitbag. You silly little shitbag. Let's get you. Now, I suppose before we launch this thing, Probably drop that. Just saying, might be a good idea. Oh, look. Man, these guys are everywhere. Like cockroaches. Cool. Did get the other ones well, didn't we? Wait, did you not drop anything for me? Seriously? Dick. All right, well, whatever. Now, let's go get tooled up. Because the best stasis is free stasis. We all know that. Ah, oh, look at this place. Love the design of the Ishimura. Just looks wicked. Like, so industrial. Nothing over there? Nothing this side? Nope. I mean, the texture work in this game is not fantastic, but it certainly does the job. Warning. Payload 8772 is no longer tethered. Untrained personnel must leave the mining bay immediately. Right, let's go. So that thing is now basically just hanging off the ship. Right, are we good? Think we're good. Alright. Exiting zero gravity. 
done and done. I can hear something gribbly. Oof. Oh, hello. You know what? Let's see if we can just grind these guys into a pulp. Save some ammo and equipment. Death by grinding. Especially when we're this close to a way of recharging. <laughs> exactly, Isaac. Fuck you. You're done? You have been. We've got a free resource, so I guess we might as well use it. Alright, cool. I guess, yep, we're gonna go launch the asteroid. What could possibly go wrong with that plan? Probably everything. Oh, good. This looks fun. Um, it's certainly got hot in here. Jeez. That's all right. That's okay. Bit of heat never hurt anybody. I guess. Whew. Glad to be out of there. Certainly got spicy. Alright, let's lock you in. Now, go launch the asteroid, I guess. Or actually, we're on like half an hour now, and Mrs. is about to come back, so we'll give it a save, and then when we come back, we're going to go launch the asteroid. Because it seems like the right thing to do. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching, and as always, till next time.